This is build number 22,000. You can't expect your team to manage work with this. With Monday.com's flexible management system, power. Did you ever sit down and think, I want to have my phone in my computer?
There's a phone companion. Here's what it looks like. <laughs> this is a phone companion from Microsoft and um, this phone companion is it's a um, a new way to connect. See, got all my messages here. It's connected through Bluetooth, and uh, and uh, see, all these are my Android apps that I run from my phone, and uh, yeah, and uh, when I text somebody, it actually links in with my phone so I can actually text and call. If I make a phone call, I'll be able to hear the audio through the computer. And uh, pretty much hear the audio through the computer. And this is what's cool about Windows 10. Also, through the Bluetooth, can access your photos uh, from your phone. Um, see, I've got all my photos from my phone, and you can see you can see all my photos and everything. all my photos. See? And then there's apps. You can run Android apps on Windows. But I'm not currently using the Wi-Fi network right now. I'm using my data connection, but as you can see, the apps are pretty much on my desktop. <laughs> on Windows 11 and Windows 11 came out. I don't and uh, pretty, pretty nice. These are all my apps that I use. I got Firefox. And in phone contacts, you can actually view your contacts. Remotely, I can call someone on my computer to link into my phone and my phone will call if I need and it will text from the computer using link software this uh, companion app the new Microsoft companion and you can see my phone Samsung A32 it says William A32 and really nice to have and I got Spotify Netflix
different from other versions of Windows. Microsoft changed the way it was used. And, uh, yeah. And to get to all the old apps, like the Windows Media Player and Sexa, so there's Windows Tools. You open up Windows Tools, and then all the older Windows functions for the desktop are inside the Windows Tool folder. Yes, they are inside the Windows Tool folder. Yes, the Windows Tool folder, and then there's WordPad and Remote Desktop and Run, Auto Run, Computer Management. And also to get to some other features like device manager, you have to click the Windows button now. Because once you click the taskbar button, it'll just give you taskbar settings. And then if you want to get to device manager, you have to click the Windows button and open. You see all my Bluetooth devices. I had to plug in a USB Realtek 5.0 device because the 4.2 driver wasn't compatible with Windows 11. So I'm using a um, using a uh, using a USB uh, Realtek adapter. And, uh, yeah. And, uh, so right here is some recording software. Use OBS. And it's free. So, yeah. Uh, and, uh, yeah. And then there's the get started thing, Groove Music, Microsoft Edge. Now, to be clear, Internet Explorer is no longer part of Windows. Internet Explorer, Microsoft got rid of already. It no longer supported in Windows 11, which is fine. I find it quite easy to use uh, Microsoft Edge. Yeah, I find it quite easy. Um, pretty much. Yeah, so that's about it. Thank you for watching, and subscribe.